I saw that there were a lot of people in pain, people suffering on the street, so I knew how to do something. A local college is recognizing students not just for their work in the classroom, but for their commitment to the community. The University of St. Francis is giving away three pay-it-forward scholarships, one for full tuition for four years and two for half tuition. A selection committee has chosen the finalists, and the winner will be announced at the end of the month. News Channel 15 is giving you the chance to meet the exceptional teenagers. Tonight, a senior from Angola High School. Luis Sosa Manubes isn't like most kids in his Spanish class. He grew up in Mexico and already speaks the language fluently. The experiences he had there as a child shaped him into the young man he's become. I saw that there were a lot of people in pain, people suffering on the street, kids, kids on the street. They had no food. So I knew how to do something. And do something he did. I created my own non-profit organization called San Jose Sanchez del Rio, Apostolado, and it was only teenagers, it was only me and my friends, and I was like the leader, I began with that, and it was only like six people at the beginning, but then it kind of grew like real fast, and then we had 10 people, 20, then hundreds, and I organized all of that. They took food to people on the streets, visited nursing homes, bought clothes for the needy, they started with the goal of giving back once a month, but the need was so great, and Luis and his friends enjoyed it so much that it became a weekly thing. And I was like, I have privileges that many people don't have, so the least I, could, I can do is try to share that with, me, with the, people, the world. Like, God gave me a lot of stuff, so I think it's fair just to give back to the world. That philosophy didn't stop once he and his family moved to Texas. I remember in my junior year, I had this girl, she was from Honduras, and she needed to finish a project to graduate, like, she was a senior, and she needed to finish that, but she had no idea what to do. So, I was helping her for two weeks after school, for like, two or three hours, and she finished her project, and she graduated. That's you know? a good feeling. And I was so happy, because I felt like I was able to do something. Another move led the family to Angola, where Luis is wrapping up his high school career. You made a girl warmer. To him, the phrase, pay it forward, is more than just words. It means when you get something, like, you know, sharing is caring. You know, when you get something, I think it's your duty to give it to other people. You know, you just have to help from your heart. As for the future, Luis would like to study psychology or business, and he's also interested in theater. And next week, we will introduce you to a Concordia student who's also a scholarship finalist. Find out why she says she feels called to give back.